Hey, America, Shamagov here. America should be everywhere. Let's get this going everywhere, not just America. Anyway, I took a ride through Watertown. I didn't find anywhere I really wanted to eat. Nothing came out to me, and uh, I didn't try to talk to a few people. Nobody was in the mood to talk. Uh, there, lots of people are busy. It's Friday. What the hell? they got to move on with their day. Not everyone needs to talk to a nut that's on the street just trying to make conversation. I get it. Tough crowd, tough crowd. Every so often you hit a tough crowd. What are you going to do? Anyway, I decided I'm going to drive along and see if anything comes to mind. But while I'm driving through Watertown, I come along a basketball court. There's a group of kids playing on one side. And there's one little kid. He couldn't quite reach the basket. And he kept trying and kept trying. And I said, boy, that looks like me all alone. Just determined to get that damn ball in that hoop. Going to stay there all day till I get it. And one of the big kids, he, he stopped to help the little kid with the ball. And he showed him how to do a diaper shot. And the little kid shot the ball. And he just missed. And the big kid gave it back to him. And he shot the ball again. He got it in. He was so excited. And he lit up. And, you know, I, I wasn't going to make any videos that were bad. And I got two brothers. One that always had time for me. The other one, not so much. And maybe that's because the old one picked on him. He picked on me. I always... I tried not to be a bully. I tried to bust balls. That's what I do best. My oldest brother was great at it, but to my other brother, yeah, maybe he was a bully to him. And it rolled downhill, and I'm on the bottom of that hill. So anyway, that being said, I saw this little kid, and I said, boy, that's just like my brother Michael. No matter what he was doing, and even with he, if he was with all the boys, he'd find ways and find time and make a little time for me. And my other brother, not so much. He just had his own thing, and I was too little. Go away. So if you're a big brother or you're somebody a little kid looks up to, make that extra effort. Give him a little time because you know what? That little bit of time you make for that kid, that could change their life. That's all I got to say. I said I was going to do these 10 minutes at a time. My daughter said, Dad, when are you going to write? I said, I'll make reminders for myself, and if I ever get around to it, I'll add more dialogue and more stuff to it and we'll see where it goes from there but hang hang with me america we're looking at my psyche we're looking at my trek with god and i'm noticing things and maybe i was a bully sometimes maybe i still am i gotta work on these things i'm a work in progress i think we all are as long as we keep realizing that and we keep striving for what's right we'll get there america belief in god's a good thing i know that now I'm just trying to share it with everyone else. You don't need miracles. Not all the time. They're all around us. We make the miracles sometimes. I believe that. I'm working on it. One person at a time. Hang with me. Hit that like, share, subscribe. Let's see where we can go. I'll let you know if anything funny happens. We gotta still find some way to eat. Oh yeah, that's why I made this video. I forgot why I stopped. <laughs> I was... Looking at this place called Classic, what's it called? Classic America is the glass company. But underneath that is High Octane Classics. It's in Auburn. That's where I'm at now, Auburn, Mass. Anyway, I just let the GPS tell me where to go and figure I'll find somebody to talk to. <laughs> Aren't you glad you're not my neighbor? Anyway, yeah, <laughs> I had a funny story. I won't say it because, nah, never mind. She was funny, though. Anyway, High Octane, if you like the movie Cars, check this place out and take a ride through the back. I swear, every car, old-fashioned, the low riders, all the cool stuff, they've got every one of them back there. It's amazing. It's open. I don't think it's illegal to take a ride, and they sell the cars. So if you get a chance and you happen to see High Octane Classics, give it a look. It's worth it. place is awesome. Anyway, hit that like, share, subscribe. One of these days I'll figure out where I'm supposed to look on this camera too to make it look like I have actual eye contact. Is that better? Is that better, that better, that better, that better. I don't know. Hey, I don't think I swore on this one. It's a work in progress. <laughs> anyway, make a little time for those kids. All right, have fun. I'm going to see what my day brings me.